Hello, Carlota. Good evening. Hello, hello, Carlota. Good evening. Carlota, hello, good evening, buenas noches, Carlota. Buenas noches, no sé si... Yes, I listen to you. Mm -hmm. Buenas noches. Yes, I listen to you, Carlota. Mm -hmm. I guess the internet is giving you problems. Yes, the internet connection.
Hello, good evening. Jose, Chris. Hello. Hello. How are you? Fine. Fine. Excellent. Fine. Very good. So happy to hear that. Okay, so we are missing some other participants to join um, our um, call for today, our class, our video conference for today. So we are going to wait for them like two more minutes and then we start. Yes. Yeah, I was fixing something from my um, uh, computer, but now I fixed it. So, Crisia, how was your day at work today? Fine, heavy, difficult, easy. How was your day at work today? At work. So, día en el trabajo. How was it? ¿Cómo fue? Good, bad. Good, good, good. Okay, very good. Nice. A lot of work. A lot of work. Too much work. Con mucho trabajo. Muchos que hacer. Yes. Yes, yes. And do you teach um, teenagers, right? I remember that you told us. Mm -hmm. Hello, Yesenia. Good evening, Yesenia. How are you? Let's see. There we are. Okay, so it's time. Um, it's already time. So let's begin, dear participants. Once again, welcome, welcome to the class. We um, have today our video conference number four. So in our video conference number four, we are practicing, a, we are, first of all, we identify and then we practice possessive adjectives and nouns. Hello, Carla, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hello, hello, hello. How are you? Everything good? Fine, and you? Fine, yeah, very good. Thank God. Reina, hello. Good evening, Reina. Welcome, Yesenia. Hello. Hi, teacher. Hello, Ibev. Good evening. Hello. Reina. Welcome, hello, hello. So, Magdaleno, hello. Good evening. Hello, good night, good evening. Lisa, hello. So let's begin, let's start. As I was telling you before, today's, um, today's session, today's video conference is related to the possessive adjectives. So we have the opportunity today to practice, first of all, as I told you, to identify what possessive adjectives are. And at the same time, we are going to practice them. So let's start video conference number four. And welcome, once again, welcome. We are so happy to have you in here. So let's see, 
today is. Um, let's think about it. What day is today, students? What's today's date? Can you tell me? Tuesday. Tuesday. Uh -huh. Tuesday or Thursday? Ah, uh -huh. Thursday. Thursday, uh huh. In what month? Eighty. Uh, eight. Eight, uh huh. But the month? January. July. March? Ah. July. July. <laughs> Excellent. July. Very good. July. Yes. Uh huh. Yes, that is totally right. Today is Thursday, July the eighth, two thousand and twenty-one, or. 2021. This is the day of today. Thursday, July the 8th, 2021. Yes. So, once again, welcome. And it's time for us to um, yes. So, let's see what we have uh, today. Lucia, hello. We are going to start right now. This is the class objective. This is the objective for today's class. And it's the following. You participants at the end of this session will be able to know how to identify and use possessive adjectives and nouns. So that is the goal. That is the objective of today's session to recognize, to use, in other words, possessive adjectives and nouns. So that's what we had for today. Yes. Perfect, 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 perfect. Tell me, students, did you practice the alphabet today as we studied yesterday? Did you practice the alphabet? Practicaron el abecedario, el alfabeto? Según lo que vimos ayer, based on what we practiced yesterday. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. No? Yes. Yes, I am. Yes. Aha, uh -huh. excellent. So if I tell you right now, well, if I ask you to tell me the alphabet, you are. Yes, that's me. Okay. O sea que si les pregunto ahora el alfabeto completo, me lo dicen. Luz, hello, good evening, sorry, I didn't say hello. Good evening. <laughs> sorry, ajá. Uh -huh. So, you tell me, right? Ajá. Uh -huh. O sea que si les pregunto, me lo dicen ahora. Easy. Yes, Easy. sir. Really? Okay, ajá. Uh -huh. Magdaleno, tell me. Ajá. <laughs> uh -huh. Let's see. Soy un botón. <laughs> you said it, so, ajá. Uh -huh. Tell okay. us, Magdaleno. Okay. Um, e, uh, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Z, excellent. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Very good, yes. Excellent. Very good, Magdaleno. Good, good job. Good, good job. Excellent. So somebody else, students, participants, is there someone else who wants to share? Uh-huh. Someone else, another participant. Hello, good evening. Um, Mauricio, good evening. So somebody else who learned, who memorized the alphabet. Alguien más que se aprendió el alfabeto? Lo practicó más bien. You practiced yesterday and today. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Nobody else. Nobody else. Okay, Reina. Yes. Uh -huh. Yes. Go ahead. Reina. Uh -huh. Yes, Reina? Yes. Um, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. Very good. Excellent. Good job. Good, good job. Excellent. Yes. 
That is totally, totally correct. Mm -hmm. That's how you say the alphabet, right? Um, yes. Can you tell? Well, you, we discussed, actually, we mentioned yesterday that we have consonants and vowels, right? Uh, in, in the alphabet, of course, as part of the alphabet. And we mentioned that some of the consonants are B, C, D, F, G, H, J, K. Uh -huh. That is correct. But what about the vowels? Which are the vowels? We have five vowels. Uh -huh. Which are the five vowels? Uh -huh. the students? Participants, which are the five vowels? ¿Cuáles son las cinco vocales? Uh -huh. A, A, I, 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 o, I o, 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 U. 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 Excellent. Very good. Very, very good. Do you remember the question? How do you spell? Do you remember that? Yes? Yes. Okay. Excellent. Uh, let's see. Uh -huh. Yes. Uh, Mauricio, how do you spell banana in English? Mm -hmm. Banana. It's... I cannot listen to you, Mauricio. I don't know why. Speak. Uh -huh. Speak. No. No, we cannot listen to you. I don't know why we cannot listen to you. Uh-huh. I don't know. Maybe try check checking there the mm -hmm. your microphone. Yes. In the meantime, I'm giving the opportunity to somebody else. Mientras eh, Mauricio revisa, eh, vamos con alguien más. Uh -huh. eh, how do you spell banana, students? Mm -hmm. In general, whoever wants to answer, okay? Uh -huh. Carla? B A N A N A. Excellent. It's banana. That's correct. It's totally correct. Uh, let me see. Magdaleno, how do you spell computer? Computer is C O M P U T E R. It's computer. E R. R, uh -huh. E R, e -R. Computer. it's computer, very good, very, very good, it's computer, excellent, good, good job, so you see students, actually, that's what we practiced yesterday, as you remember, we work a little bit on the, um, what, we work on many things related to the alphabet, we practice the spelling of the alphabet, right, for example, how do you spell teacher? It's T-E-A-C-H-E-R, teacher, right? That's what we practiced yesterday. Excellent. So the topic of today's class, uh, of today's conference, uh, yeah, I can, we cannot listen to you, Mauricio. I, I don't know why. Perhaps that's the problem, yeah. What you are saying in the chat, maybe that's the problem. Mm -hmm. Yes, maybe it needs a refresh or something like that. Mm -hmm. Okay, students, so let's have a look. This is our um, uh, topic for today. The topic for today is possessive adjectives and nouns. Before we start this, I want to present to you what a noun is. So pay a lot of attention um, in the meantime, while you are taking notes or doing whatever uh, related to this, I'm going to call the attendance since many of you have joined already. So I need to check the attendance. Remember, uh, just say present, right? That's all you have to do. Let's start. Uh, Carlota, Carlota Hueso de Cepeda. Mm -hmm. She's here, but she's having problems with the microphone. Claudia Lisette Garcia Ramos, eh, Resinos, sorry. Claudia Lisette Garcia Resinos. Claudia. Mm 
Mm -hmm. Claudia, is Claudia here? Don't forget to activate your microphones. Present. Ah, okay. Thank present, you. Present, present. Okay. Diana Margarita Campos. Diana Margarita Campos Benitez. Present, teacher. Excellent. Idalia Serrano Martinez. Iliana Idalia. Present. Present, present teacher. Present. Excellent. Present, teacher. Okay, excellent. Uh, Jose Arnoldo. Corea, Jovel. Present. Very good. Iván Portillo Márquez. Jose Iván Portillo Márquez. Present. Very good. Carla Patricia Pineda López. Present. Crisia Vanessa Enriquez Monterrosa. Present. Lisette del Carmen Pineda Ventura. Present. Lucía Gabriela Vázquez Mengíbar. Present. Luz Angélica Muñoz Bustillo. Present. Magdaleno Escalante Orantes. Present. Mauricio Isaí Calderón Esquivel. Present. Raúl Oswaldo. Uh, now we listen to you. Yes. Now we listen to you. Ahora sí lo escuchamos, Mauricio. Ok, ok, qué bueno. Eh, Raúl Oswaldo Ramírez Fabián. He hasn't joined yet. Not connected yet. Reina Guadalupe Rivas Ventura. Present. Sara Judith Miranda Cruz. Stephanie Emperatriz Orellana Castillo. Stephanie. Tomasa y Beth Ramírez Castillo. Yes. Verónica, ok, Verónica Yasmín Ramírez. Here. And Yesenia Elizabeth Cárcamo Serrano. Present. Present. Very good. Very, very good. Thank you, participants. Thank you very much. Yes, I appreciate it. Ok, so let me explain to you what this is all about. Diana Margarita. Yeah. Eh, teacher, eh, Sara Miranda está en parcial otra vez. Ok. Está en semana de parciales. Ok. Thanks for informing me. Después Thank se you. va a conectar, dijo. Ok. Thank you. I appreciate it. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Ok, students. So today we are going to practice this, this interesting topic. It's about nouns. So first, let's see the definition of a noun. What is a noun? A noun is referred to all the objects, for example, computer, television, radio, ball, a cell phone, charger. Charger, I told you, refrigerator, cell phone, calculator, those are objects, right? Objects, objects, things that we normally use. Forms, forms, for example, let's say um, the sky, some things that are like some things that tend to be abstract, like the sky, love, right? Um, like that. Places, for example, El Salvador, eh, Ataco, right? Let's see what else. Eh, United States of America, Costa Rica. So places, places. Eh, let's see what else. Ruta de las Flores, that is another place. Monte Cristo, all of those, right? And people. People, that means your names. We are talking about you. For example, Crisia, Kevin, Claudia, Luz Angelica, Mauricio, Diana. Names of people. Those are nouns as well. Okay, students? Is it clear? Estamos claros en esa parte? Respondanme con un yes or no. Uh -huh. Is it clear? Yes. Teacher, I, I yes. have a noun. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. Uh, busqué traducción de noun. 
-hmm. y es sustantivo. Yes. Ajá, es sustantivo. Entonces estoy confundido. Uh -huh. eh, son los, entiendo con, con la definición que da que son los nombres abstractos. Yeah. Y no Objects. le entendí, no alcancé a traducir cuando usted mencionaba las personas y mencionó nombres. Ahí, donde, ahí es donde me he confundido. People. People. Ajá. Ajá. Ahí no le entendí si people, incluía... people is the plural. Ajá. People is the plural of person. Ajá. Ajá. For example, the name of a person. Magdaleno. The name of a girl. Carla, for example. Carla. Yvette. Mauricio. Names of people. Gente. Nombre de las personas. O sea, que incluye los nombres. Yes. Of los course. nombres serían un noun también. They are. Yes. Ok. Esa They era. Are. This is my doubt. That doubt. was your doubt. Ok. Doubt. Excellent. That is my doubt. Very Thank good. You. Very, very good. Yes, I understand. Mm -hmm. Very good. So, yes. So they are referred to the objects, forms, places, and people. For example, pencil. Uh -huh. Do you know what a pencil is? Students, do you know what a pencil is? What is a pencil? It's an object. It's an object. object. Uh -huh. Yes. Do you have a pencil with you? Tienen un pencil con ustedes ahí a la mano? Yes, I have. Ah, excellent. Very good. Very good. Uh -huh. Yes. Very good. Uh -huh. Pencil, right? That's an object. Pencil object. Uh, Luz Angelica, person. That means people. A place. Uh, Santiago Nonualco, for example. That is a place, right? A taco. A uh, Hikilisco, right? Those are places. And the nouns, the nouns can be singular or plural. Well, not or plural, and plural. Singular and plural. For example, camera. What is a camera? What's a camera? A camera, it's that artifact, that object that people use for taking pictures, oh. right? Exactly, photos, uh -huh. people take pictures, photos, right? So that is camera, that is in singular. What is singular? Singular is one, one. Uh -huh. What is singular, students? What is that? It means it's one, one, one. one. Uh -huh. one. And then we have plural, what is plural? Two, two or three, more. Three, more, two more exactly. Uh -huh. more. Two, three, four, and more, 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 more. Okay. So that is right. That is plural. Camera, cameras, pencil, pencils, notebook, notebooks. Computer, computers, desk, 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 desk. Ah, teacher, this is like desktop. Yes, it's similar. Uh -huh. Desk, desk, box, boxes, box. Boxes. What is a box, students? Do you know what's that? What's a box? Sorry. Exactly that object, right? Where people save other smaller objects, right? That is a box, singular one, and then we have boxes, which is plural, right? That is plural. Mm -hmm boxes uh, then we have watch watches what is a watch a watch is for example this is your hand this is your wrist in this part you have like a bracelet right you have like a bracelet in which you watch and you see ah what time is it it's 20 
It's 21 past eight, for example. You check the time in the watch. Okay, students? Got it? Mm -hmm. You watch it there. You see it there, the watch. You wear it in here. Aquí es donde usan todos un? Watch. Ajá, un watch. ¿Qué es un watch? Watch. Un? Reloj. Un reloj. The Ajá. clock. Reloj. Exactly. Ajá, yes. That is correct. That is totally correct. That's a watch, right? Mm -hmm. That's a watch. That means for your risk. Ahí se los estoy colocando en el chat. Un watch es para un risk. Un reloj es para una muñeca, o sea, para la muñeca de su mano, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. your, your, like, risk. And then, we, and then we have a clock. Y, teacher, y entonces los que están en la pared, los que ponemos en la pared grande, ¿cómo se llamarían? Esos son clock. Clock or clocks. In plural. Okay? People? Mm -hmm. Clock. Clocks. That's how you call it, right? That is how you call it. Clock. Clocks. Mm -hmm. Okay, students, is it clear? Clear, clear? Sorry, sorry, sorry uh -huh. teacher, I have a question. Yes, Magdalena. Okay, I see that someone work uh, finishes in boxes. Uh -huh. No, box, box. I, yes, uh -huh. uh, do you have someone ruler for Rules. this? Uh, Yes, in this, uh -huh, in, in this case, when the words, uy, sorry, when, when the words finish with the letter X or CH, you are going to use this combination, ES, for Only every number. Only for oh. those. In this Two moment, case. those are the um, necessary ones to consider. Uh -huh. Box, boxes. Watch watches. Okay. When they finish on this C H and X. Okay, Magdaleno. It's clear. Thank you, uh -huh. teacher. Perfect. Very good. Participants, another question. Mm -hmm. Another question. Yes. Another question. Alguna otra duda? Mm -hmm. More questions, participants? No? Yes, no? Uh -huh. Remember, practice, practiquen. Digan sí o no, recuérdense. Tienen que practicar. Uh -huh. Active, active participation. Yes, no? Questions, dudas no sobre question. esto? Uh -huh. No. No? Thank you. Uh -huh. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, are you ready to create some examples? Ready? Ready, ready to create some examples? Ready? ready? Okay, so do me a favor, write down four ready. nouns, please. Okay. Write down four nouns in your notebook in this moment, please. Four nouns in your notebook. Just four. In this moment, I just need four. Four nouns in your notebook. Go. Mm -hmm. Only four, please. Four nouns in your notebook. Ready. Okay, Luz, Angelica, very good, very good. Very, very good.
finished, teacher. Very good, Ileana. Thank you. I finished. Excellent, I Magdaleno. Finished. Very good. We check in some minutes. We are checking together in some minutes. Mm -hmm. Ah, the others finished, los demás, finalizamos, yeah? Finish, finish? Yes, teacher. Yes, okay. Okay, very good. Give me your nouns, please. Let's start with Luz Angelica. Mm -hmm. On, rule, uh, you need in singular and plural? Both, no problem. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, park. Mm -hmm. And Raquel. Very good. Thank you, Luz. Uh, let's see, Ileana. The nose form, the circle. Yeah. And a square. A square. A, a windows. Windows. And cup. 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 A cup. Yes. Okay. Very good. Yes. Excellent. And door. And uh, door. Okay. Very door. good. Yeah. It's true. Thank you. Magdaleno. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Ileana. Very good. Magdaleno. Okay. Yo tenía door. Uh, no table, problem. tables. Table and tables. Mm -hmm. Door and doors. Share and shares, hat, hat and hat, and um, 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 uh, pant and pant. Okay, very good. Yes, that's totally, totally correct. Excellent, students. Very good. Very, very good. Questions about this, people? Do you have questions? Questions about the nouns? Preguntas, dudas sobre los nouns? Do you have questions, students? Teacher. Yes. Pants uh, in singular is the same in plural. Fan. Pants. Aha, uh -huh. fan, fans. No, pants. Yeah. Pantalón. Ah, pants, yeah, it's the same. Aha. Yeah. Uh -huh. It's the same. Okay. It is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It is totally. Mm -hmm. Yes, very good. Yesenia, one noun, please. Please, Yesenia, one noun. Un sustantivo, Yesenia. De los que usted escribió, from the ones you wrote. Yesenia. Eh, no sé. Bueno, yo, yo puse te, table. Table, creo que. Eh, table. Repeat it, please, Yesenia. Repeat it. Type, type it. Typing. Uh huh. Uh, no, in that case, it has to, it has to be. I guess you wanted to say table, right? I guess. Creo que quería decir oh. table. Yes. Otro que haya escrito. La pronunciación no muy bien, pero. Ok. Uh, sí. uh -huh. Ok. Uh, otro que haya escrito, Yesenia. Another that you wrote. Bob. Uh, boat. Uh -huh. Boat. Boat. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Boat. Yes. Boat. Very good. Thank you. Thank you very much. Excellent, students. So remember. Ajá. I have a question. Yes, Ileana, tell me your question. Uh, the people famous is unique or no, known or other? Uh, famous people? Yes. 
Eh, yes, is they the are. Only, is the only knows? Eh, no, not necessarily, but they are part. They are part. They go under that category of people, Ileana. Uh -huh. ah, like, okay. yes, mm -hmm. they are part uh -huh. in that ah, okay. space, in that category of people. Uh -huh. Yes. Ah, okay. They go. Okay, Thank you. Excellent. Very good. More questions about this? ¿Alguna otra duda sobre esto? Yes, no? Stephanie, Veronica, welcome, bienvenidas. Uh -huh. Steph, Veronica. Uh -huh. Teacher. Yes, no Lisette. I have a question. Uh -huh. um, life and plural. Life, yes. Uh -huh. Life and lives. Uh -huh. Lives. Exactly, okay. correct. Yes, that is possible. Perfect. Thank you. Thanks to you. Excellent. Good job. Good job. Mm -hmm. Very good. Yes. Life, lives, right? Excellent. Good job. So we have again camera. Repeat, please, all together. Camera, 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 camera. pencil. Camera. Pencil, pencil, notebook, notebook, computer, 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 desk, 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 box, box. Watch. 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 Okay. So let me see. Uh -huh. Yes, Ileana. Correct. So this is what we're going to do. Uh, Carla, how do you spell watches in English? Mm -hmm. It's. W A T C H E S. Excellent. Very good. Very, very good. Good. Excellent. Mauricio, how do you spell pencil in English? It's P E N C I O. Very good. Excellent. Good job. Reina, how do you spell boxes in English? It's B O X. Boxes. Boxes. E S. Sorry. E S. Ah, uh, excellent. Very good. E Beth. Yeah. Uh huh. E Beth. How do you um? How do you spell notebook? M O T E B O O Q. K. Okay. K. Okay. Okay. Uh huh. Very good. Very, very good. Yes, that is correct. Uh, Jose Correa, how do you say computers? No, how do you say? How do you spell? I mean, how do you spell computers? C O M P U T E R. Computers. Computers. <laughs> C O M P U T E R. E R S. Excellent. Very good. Very, very good. Excellent. Yes. Yo sé que han de decir, uy, el teacher sí nos está presionando cuatro clasecitas y ya nos puso mucho vocabulario, mucha practice, right? Yes. <laughs> And actually, the purpose is for you to practice, right? For you to learn. Very good. Excellent. So, no more questions. Ninguna otra duda sobre esto. Can I move on? Yes. Can, I, can I move on? No question, you can. Excellent. Very good. So today we're going to focus on this. Subject pronouns and possessive adjectives. So we are going to see which ones they are. As you remember, students, in the classes one, two, and three, we practiced with the subject pronouns in both negative and affirmative statements and questions, right? I am a teacher, you are a doctor. Is he a doctor? Am I a teacher? 
we are co-workers, are we co-workers? So we practiced all of that, right? Today, we are going to contrast, we are going to compare subject pronouns and possessive adjectives. Which are the subject pronouns? We have I, you, he, she, it, you, they, and we. For example, I am an English teacher. You are an executive, an executive of sales or sales executive. He is an architect. She is a veterinarian. It is, it is hot today. Look, look at me, students. Look at me. Miren ahorita. It's hot right now. Do you know this? It's hot when it's very, very hot. Sorry. Yeah, it's hot in this place. Exactly. Uh huh. It's hot. Yes or no? Yes. yes. Is it hot? Uh huh. Is it, it hot? Is. Yes, yes, it is. It is. Yes, it is. Excellent. Very good. Very good. Mm -hmm. Are pupusas delicious? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Listen. Are pupusas delicious? Yes. Yes, it is. They are. Uh -huh. they, yes, are. they are. Excellent. Yes, huh? they are. Plural, yes, yes, they are. Uh -huh. Yes, don't forget that, right? The subject has to be, well, your response, your answer needs to be based on that, right? Are proposals delicious? Yes, they are. Mm -hmm. They are. Yes, they are. Very good. So we practice, right? I, you, he, she, it, you, they, and we. But we also have these um, a possessive adjectives, right? And we are going to see what a possession is. When we talk about possessions, we talk about something that is mine, that belongs to me. For example, this cell phone, this cell phone, is it yours or mine? ¿De quién es ese teléfono? ¿A quién le pertenece? To you or to me? Oh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. To you, teacher. Uh -huh. It's yours. Repeat. It's yours. It's, it's yours. It's yours. yours. Uh -huh. Exactly. Yours. Right? So that is a possession. Esa es una posesión. Okay? Uh -huh. Perfect. So for those, or to describe those possessions, we use possessive adjectives. In which are the possessive adjectives? My, your, his, her, its, your, our, their. Again, my, your, his, her, it's your, our, their, my cell phone, your cell phone, his cell phone, right? Digamos que estoy marcando a Mauricio, his cell phone, su teléfono, pero me refiero a él, right? Not about me, his cell phone, Mauricio. My cell phone, your cell phone, his cell phone. Digamos, en este caso estoy señalando a Reina, her cell phone, su teléfono, her cell phone, its cell phone, su teléfono, neutral, no sabemos, ¿verdad? Específicamente de quién, its cell phone. Your cell phones, yours. Acuérdense que uno es para plural y el otro es para singular. Your cell phones, right? Eh, our cell phone, nuestro. Our cell phone. Their cell phone. 
Okay, students, participants, is it clear? Clear, clear? It's clear. Clear. Okay, select one and elaborate one example, please. Select one, elijan uno y elaboren un pequeño ejemplo usándolo, please. Just one. For example, my, uh, what? How can I tell you? My computer, mi computadora, my computer. Okay, so do it, please. Finish. Finish, okay. Uh -huh. Your example, Luz Angelica? Her daughter. Her daughter, uh -huh. very good. Another, students? Another, uno más, otro, otro. My shoes, her class. My shoes, uh -huh. My pet. My pet, another? Her class. Her class, uh -huh. My family. My family, excellent, Yesenia. Uh -huh. Another? My mother. My mother. Mm -hmm. Ileana? Uh, my shirt. My shirt. Uh -huh. My shirt. Uh -huh. Your computer. Exactly. Your computer. Mm -hmm. Very good. Yes. Uh -huh. So, teacher. My okay. shoes. Exactly. Correct. Uh -huh. Correct. Very good. Teacher, o sea que también podemos decir con personas. Podemos usarlo con personas. Digamos, my. Sí. Digamos, o sea que puedo decir my girlfriend. My boyfriend. My boyfriend. They, okay. So, they are part of a relationship with you? Yes. Yeah. No son exactamente una posesión de ustedes. Bueno, sí, verdad. But, but you, I mean, you can call it like that, right? My, your, his, her, right? So that's how you call it. Magdaleno, uh huh. Um, aquí está. Okay. Um, our house. Our house. Nuestra casa, our, nuestro hogar. Our house. Uh -huh. My, teacher. look. My. My teacher. Uh -huh, my the, my teacher. My teacher. Uh -huh. Yes, my teacher. Uh -huh. No, esa posesión no la quiero. <laughs> my teacher. Okay, perfect. Yes, so like that, right? That's how you use it. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Let's see. Uh, let's have a look at more examples. Well, here we uh, have some more examples. My pencil, your pencil, his pencil, her pencil, its pencil, our pencil, your pencil, their pencil, okay? My, your, his, her, its, our, your, there. My sandwich, for example. My sandwich, his sandwich, her sandwich, our sandwich, their sandwiches, its sandwich, my 
My car, his car, her car, our car, like that. Magdaleno? Uh, sí. Uh, excuse me. Um, my, my, answer, my question is about its pencil. I don't know the translate to the Spanish. For example, it's uh -huh. what for is example, the translate? For example, Magdaleno and its uh, pets are disturbing. Digamos que, por ejemplo, es un ejemplo. Eh, mm -hmm. Magdaleno and its dogs are disturbing the peace. Magdaleno y sus mascotas and its pets are wow. disturbing. Ajá. Es como, es como its, el its es como un punto neutro para todos los demás. Me explico. Porque también puede ser Crisia and its what? Long schedule. Crisia y su largo horario de trabajo. Ok. Crisia and its long. También lo estoy usando para ella. No necesariamente estoy usando her. O para usted, eh, Magdaleno, his, right? Sino que es como algo neutro, algo neutral. Uh -huh. Ok, lo usaría entonces para mencionar cosas. Ajá. Sería, por ejemplo. Por ejemplo, también para, no solo para cosas, sino que para lugares. Por ejemplo, El Salvador and its people are nice. El Salvador y su gente son amables, right? Ok, yes, ejemplos. Me, me aclaró, me aclaró la duda. Ok. Ok. Uh -huh. Thank you. Yes. Apaneca and its culture. Apaneca y su cultura. Ok, people. Okay. Another question. Another yes. question. No, no more question. Thank you. Okay, very good. So do me a favor, please, students. Do the same I have done in here, please. Write down, change the object, and write down all of these possessive adjectives like this. My, your, his, her, its, our, your, and their. Tal cual yo lo hice acá, solo que cambien el objeto o los objetos. Cambien todos los objetos para que se vea más natural, más practice of you, please. Mm -hmm. Yeah, more practice of you. Questions, Stephanie? Questions, questions? Dudas, Stephanie? Alguna pregunta? Yes, no? Okay. Verónica, questions? Preguntas, Verónica? Verónica Ramírez. Uh -huh. No questions, no. Ok. Uh, Magdaleno, ajá. Podría repetir lo que vamos a hacer, que mi interés está fallando. Ok. Por favor. Yes, yes, Carla. Eh, you have to um, copy all of this. Possessive adjectives, my, your, his, her, all of this. And, and uh, change the objects, change the nouns. For example, my car, your banana, his house, like that. Okay, Carla? Okay, thank you. Okay.
finish. Okay. Okay, very good, very good. What about the others? Lucia, did you finish? Lucia, Gabriela, finish? No. Not yet? Okay. Finish. Finish, excellent. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Do you know something about Oswaldo? No? No idea. Alguien sabe algo de Oswaldo? Finish. Finish. Okay. Finish. Excellent. Very good. Very, very good. Uh -huh. Excellent. Excellent. Excellent job, students. Very good. Perfect. So this is what we're going to do right now. Um, Give me some examples, just two examples, please. Stephanie, two examples, please. Mm -hmm. Yes, Stephanie, two examples. Activate your microphone. Mm -hmm. Hmm. I cannot listen to you. We cannot listen to you. Uh, let me see, Ibeth, can you give me one example, please, Ibeth? Mm -hmm. Your microphone, Ibeth. People, don't forget to have your microphone ready, okay? Mm -hmm. Yes, Ibeth. Okay, my book. Mm -hmm. My book. Your your cell your cell phone your cell phone uh -huh. his his ball okay yes very good uh, um continuation continue yes. yeah one more her car her car okay thank you thank you beth very good claudia two examples please claudia garcia Two examples, Claudia, two. My song. My song, uh-huh. Uh, his pants. His family, okay. Um, Luz Angelica, one example with our and one example with their, please. Okay, our house, their phone. Excellent, very good. Uh, let me see, Reina, one example with his, please. Uh, his girlfriend and our wedding. His girlfriend, our wedding, very good, yes. Uh, Crisia, one example with its, its, I-T-S, its, uh-huh. Watch. Very good. Very, very good. Mm -hmm. Yes. Very, very good. Okay, students, now, now that you did that, you're going to extend it. Now extend it, please. Ahora extiendan. Ya, como han visto, cada clase iniciamos siempre con lo más sencillo para ir a lo más complejo, ¿verdad? Para tener el, el conocimiento bien consolidado y completo. Ahora que los que así, you're going to do it like this. My pencil is yellow and big. Ahora ya sí, como una oración completa. De todas las que han hecho, elijan tres. Our country, nuestro país, our country is rich or it's beautiful, for example. 
right? Uh, let me see. His brothers, so hermanos, his brothers are noisy. Son uh, ruidosos, are noisy, right? Don't forget to have it. You have here the possessive pronouns, my, our, his, right? And after that, you are supposed to use an adjective. For example, in this case, you are using like this, right? Mm -hmm. Do it please right now. Participants, do it like this. Okay. Mm -hmm. Three examples, bigger examples, please. ¿Cuántos ejemplos? Three. Three, Chris. Ok, finish. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Very good. Finish, teacher. Very good. Excellent. Good job. Good job. Finish teacher. Excellent. Good students. Very good. Very good. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Very hot, Carla. The, the weather. Yes, teacher. It seems like it's going to rain, right? Don't you have yeah. trees around? ¿Hay árboles cerca de usted? No. No. Not no. really. No. You are in, in your house or in the office. In my house. Ah, but not many trees around. No hay muchos árboles atrás. Para no. Alrededor. No. Ah, ok. I see. Uh -huh. Perfect. I finished, teacher. Finish, Magdaleno. Yes. Yes. Magdaleno from Siloé. Hmm. I have heard about Siloe. Siloe is, uh, it's an educational institution, right? Yes, it's church and... In, in Christian, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. Yes, it's a church and... Um, a school. A Christian school. Where? In Ilopango, no. It's, uh, it's in the border in Soyapango and Ilopango. Ah. It's just in the border. Ah, yeah, I see. Uh-huh. Got it, got it, got Did you it. know? I Did guess. You know it's I guess, I remember. Yeah, it's near <laughs> Santa Lucia, right? Yes, sir. Ah, uh-huh. Yes, yes. Nice, now I remember. Mm -hmm. uh... yes. Later, I will tell you why I know the, the place. Oh, okay, it's okay. Yes. I, I will be there waiting. <laughs> yes. Okay, students. Uh, give me your examples, please. Uh, Luz Angelica, one example. Your house is pink and white. Excellent. Very good. Lisette del Carmen, one example, please. Our class is the best. Excellent. Ooh. <laughs> example, right? <laughs> Solo es un ejemplo, ¿verdad? <laughs> okay. Uh, Mauricio, Isaú. Uh -huh. One example, please. Our nephew are pretty. Okay, our nephews. Uh, no, our our ne Well, our nephews are handsome. Uh -huh. Porque como son niños sería handsome. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh -huh. Handsome. Yes. Uh -huh. Pretty yes, yeah, más de todo para girls. Okay, perfect. Um, okay. Has they, they are kiddos. Uh -huh. Yes. Carla, Patricia. Uh -huh. Uh, my shoes is animal print. Okay, my shoes are. Or just one. O solo sería uno. My shoe. My shoe. 
No, my shoes ah, okay. are animal aha, aha. print. Okay, yes, 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 yes. <laughs> correct. Sorry, Carla, I confused you. Perdón, la confundí por un momento. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Uh, eh, yes. I have a question. Aha, Carla. What is the mean? What does it mean noise? Noise. Ruido. Ruidoso. Ah, noisy. Okay. Thank you. Aha. Yes. Very good. Aha. Uh -huh. Yes. Crisia Vanessa. Aha. Uh -huh. Yo sé que todavía no he terminado, la veo ahí elaborando sus sentences, pero one, ajá. Uh, his answer is green. Ok. Uh -huh. Diana Margarita, one example. Diana Margarita, one example. Uh -huh. Diana, Diana. Eh... My house is white colors. Okay, my house is white colors. Miss Veronica Ramirez, one example, please. Veronica. Uh, his, his car is blue. His car is blue. Excellent, yes. Jose Portillo, one example, please. Jose Portillo. Your window is small. Your window is small. Very good. Excellent, students. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Yes, that is totally correct. Now, we return to this part and we're going to see this. The apostrophes. So this combination, look at this. It says, we use apostrophe. The name of this symbol, it's called apostrophe apostrophe and then it's followed by the letter s by the consonant s and we use it to express someone's possession we use the apostrophe with s to express someone's possession la posesión de alguien si por x o y motivo no queremos usar los possessive adjectives my, your, his, her, its. Podemos auxiliarnos de una apostrofe y la letra S al final de los nouns, los nombres. For example, Maria's pencil. El lápiz de María. Ok. Maria's pencil. Apostrofe S. Carla's. What? Carla's makeup, for example. El maquillaje de Carla, right? Carla's makeup. Reina's glasses, los anteojos de Reina. Okay. Yes. Claudia's charger, el cargador de Claudia. Claudia's charger. Charger, sorry. Mario and Roberto's pencil, right? Mario and Roberto's pencil. Gabriela's pencil, right? Teacher, but what happens when it, the name finishes with the letter S? Teacher, pero que pasa si el nombre termina con la letra S? ¿Se tiene que duplicar la S? Do we have to do that? No. What you do is you change the position of the apostrophe, right? You put it at the end. That is what you do. You put the apostrophe at the end. Solo pasan el apostrophe al final, pero no le agregan más S. For example, Iris pencil. Isaías pencil. Okay? Copy this, okay. please. Ajá, copy this. Voy a dar unos dos minutitos para que copien y luego aclaramos dudas. Tengo en la lista a Reina. Yes. Sé que con esto surgen más dudas. <ríe> yes. So we're going to explain this little by little and then Magdalena. Mm -hmm.
Okay, finish. Finish. Finish, finish, finish. Okay, very, very good. Uh, yes, in this moment, we are gonna have, let's see, Reina. Yes, your question, Reina. Mm -hmm. Yes, I have a question. Mm -hmm. Is correct side my pet's name is Bailey and she is beautiful. Excellent. Very good. Yes, correct. Mm -hmm. uh, yes, excellent. Very, very good. Mm -hmm. Just repeat, is it correct? So la pregunta, is it correct? Is it? Is it uh -huh. correct? Uh -huh. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Great. Magdaleno, your question or comment? Mm -hmm. Yes, teacher. Uh, my, my question is about Apostrophe. Uh -huh. I don't. I don't know how uh, uh, how I can write apostrophe. Ah yes, the spelling. Uh huh. Okay. You, do you do you can spell? Uh, can you spell, spell it? Uh -huh. Can you spell uh -huh. it? A. Can you spell it? A. B. O. S. T R O P A P uh -huh. P H E apostrophe again A P O S T R O P H E apostrophe Okay, thank you, teacher. Yes. Very, very good. Mm -hmm. In the chat, you have it for you to. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Apostrophe. Yes, very good. Uh huh. A students, another question? Somebody else that has a question? Alguien más que tenga una pregunta about this? No, mm -hmm. I don't have any questions. No. No, no. No one, no one. Okay, perfect. So that is right. Maria's pencil. My teacher's pencil. Gabriela's pencil. Mario's and Roberto's pencil. So based on this, please. Elaborate two examples in your notebook, students. Two examples, please. In your notebook. Two examples in your notebook, please. Teacher, can you repeat me what uh, can I do? Uh, two examples like this using apostrophes. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. Finish. Finish. Finish, finish, finish. Okay. The others finish. I I finished too. You finished. Okay. Excellent. Very good. Give me your examples, please, students. Mm -hmm. Your examples. Camila's boyfriend. Camila's boyfriend. Okay. Esteban's bike. Esteban's bike. Another. Fernanda Apple. Fernanda's apple. Christian's backpack. Christian's backpack. Correct. Another. Mm -hmm. Carla's book. Carla's book. Dana Pollack. 
Okay, Por excellent. Ajá, uh -huh. correct. Yes. Filipinas shoes. Ajá. Uh -huh. Okay. Yes. Very good. Mm -hmm. Ah, uh, Mauricio, can you repeat it, please? We couldn't listen to you. Mm -hmm. Yes, very, very good. Aha, uh -huh. two more examples. Those ones, two more examples. Mm -hmm. Jose, Corea. Uh, Lizette, aha. Uh -huh. Teacher, is it correct? My father's house. My father's house, correct. Uh -huh. Okay, thank you. Okay, excellent. Mm -hmm. Yes, very, very good. My brother's video games. Uh -huh. My brother's video games. Mm -hmm. Video. Okay. Okay, very, very good. Very, very good. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh -huh. Jose Correa, Mr. Jose Correa. My mother's room. My mother's room, that is correct. Uh -huh. Perfect. My sister's motorcycle. My sister's motorcycle, yes, very good. Magdaleno. Okay. Um... Uh, Mike's college mm -hmm. and Maria's school. Okay, and Maria's school. Mm -hmm. Maria's very, school. very good. Mm -hmm. Yes, excellent. Excellent students, very good participants. As you can see, this is uh, all about the, um, what, how can I tell you? The possessive adjectives part related to possessions with apostrophes, right? So Isaiah's pencil, Maria's house. Maria's house is um is big, for example. Maria's house is long, right? It's it's immense, it's gigantic, for example, right? And the last part of the possessive adjectives related to this is whose. Para preguntar de quién es algo. En inglés, ¿cómo decimos de quién es esto? Whose this? Whose pencil is this? De quién es este lápiz? Whose pencil is this? Whose car is this? Whose computer is this? Whose backpack is this? Whose shoes are this? Whose students are this, right? Imagínense que alguien entra a la videollamada y solo los encuentra a ustedes, pero no me encuentra a mí, van a preguntar. Whose participants? Are these? ¿De quién son estos participantes? Estudiantes, right? Whose participants are these? Mm -hmm. And that's how you say it, right? That's how you ask a question using whose. Mm -hmm. Whose. Uh, whose notebook is this? This is Mauricio's notebook. This is Stephanie's notebook. This is Yvette's notebook. Okay, people? Is it clear? Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Whose, right? It's all about this. Whose? Whose notebook is this? This is Jose's notebook, for example. This is Reina's pencil. This is Crisia's house. Whose cup of coffee is this? ¿De quién es esta taza de café? Whose 
cup of coffee is this? It's Los Angelicas cup of coffee. Whose keychain is this? The king is este llavero. Whose keychain? It's Carla's keychain. Mm -hmm. Okay, people. Got it, got it. Yes, is it clear? Uh, teacher. Yes. Eh, ¿cómo, ¿Cómo dijo que, que se decía llavero? Keychain. In the chat. I, I just type it on the chat. Thank Key you. Keychain. Uh -huh. Yes, that's how you do it. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's how you do it. Very, very good. Keychain. Uh -huh. Key Excellent. Chain. Mm -hmm. Keychain. Clear, people, students, participants. Mm -hmm. Yes. It's clear. Okay, complete this, please, in your notebook. Completen estos espacios in your notebook, please. Complete these spaces in your notebook, please. All of them. Mm -hmm. Practice, practice completing them, please. This moment. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And when you finish, you let me know. Uh, in the meantime, I take the attendance. Una vez más, tomo la asistencia. I call on the attendance for you to, to, to be aware, right? Um, Carlota Hueso de Cepeda. Claudia Lisset Garcia. Claudia Lisset Garcia. Ramos. Uh -huh. uh, Claudia, is Claudia here? No? Yes, yes, she is here. Uh, Diana Margarita? Microphones. Present Mar teacher. Excellent. Ileana Idalia? Present teacher. Mr. Jose Arnoldo Correa Jovel. Present. Jose Iván Portillo Márquez. Present teacher. Miss Carla Patricia Pineda López. Present. Excellent. Doctor Crisia Vanessa uh, Enriquez. Present. Very good. Yes. Lisset del Carmen Pineda. Present. Very good. Luz Angelica Muñoz Bustillo. Present. Very good. Magdaleno Scalante Orantes. Present. Mauricio Isaí, Isaú Calderón. Present teacher. Uh -huh. I was going to call you Isaí. I don't know why. Sorry, Mauricio. Ay, me perdona, Mauricio. <laughs> uh, Raúl Oswaldo. Raúl, Reina Guadalupe. Present. Sara Judith. Not here. Stephanie Emperatriz. Orellana. Ahí está. Y me respondió ya en el chat. Present. Uh -huh. Tiene problemas con el microphone. Uh, Tomás Aybet Ramírez Castillo. Present. Excellent. Verónica Yasmín Ramírez Ramírez. Excellent. And Yesenia Elizabeth Carcamo Serrano. 
present. Very good. Very, very good. Thank you. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. uh, questions, participants? No question. No questions? Finish? Finish, finish? Finalizaron? Finish. Yes? Yes, Lola? I finish. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, so let's see. Uh, can I have, yes, Crisia, please. Whose notebook is this? This, uh huh. This is Crisia's notebook. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Very good. Uh, let me see. Whose. Mm, there you go. I don't know why I cannot. Oh, now I can see. Uh, number one, please, Lisette del Carmen. Bullet number one, la viñeta número uno. You. George. Uh -huh. uh, Carla Patricia. Number two. Mm -hmm. Or Claudia Garcia, number two. Activate your microphone. Microphone. My. Uh, my. Okay, excellent. Yes. Claudia, number three. La número tres, Claudia. Number three. Sorry? His. His. Excellent. Mm -hmm. His. Exactly. Lucia Gabriela, number four. Hair. 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 Mm -hmm. Number four, it's hair. Excellent. Very, very good. Excellent participants. Good job, good, good job. Uh, questions, comments, preguntas, comentarios? No? No, no, no? No, no question. No, okay, perfect. No questions, no answers. Okay, uh -huh. Yeah, acá en el lugar para responder. Yes. Yeah, the thing I see is the product. Yes, Carla. Air, uh, my, it, or only now. Mm, repeat it, please. I didn't understand very well your question. Eh, para, para responder de quién es algo, se puede uh -huh. usar ella, de él. Uh, yes, both options, Carla. Uh -huh. Both options. Uh -huh. For example, it's hers or it's Patricia's. For example, le, ¿puedo darle un ejemplo? ¿Puedo? Yeah. Can I? Okay. Yeah. Uh, whose, whose backpack is this? ¿De quién es esta mochila? Whose backpack is this? It's Carla's backpack or it's hers. Pero si digo it's hers, la voy a señalar a usted for reference, okay? It's hers, like that. Yeah, thank you. Ah, exactly, correct. Mm -hmm. Very good. That is how you have to say it, right? Excellent, very good. Okay, participants, uh, this is what you're going to do. Please, in your manuals, mm -hmm, page number 16, we have this, right? Like a quick review again, uh, possessive adjectives and possessive nouns, right? So we have in here, my, your, his, her, it's, our, their, my notebook, your backpack, his office. Un lugar puede ser de nosotros también, teacher, yeah. His office, his classroom, his house, right? His car, her, 
her pet, her cat, right? It's hair, for example, it's hair is long. Su cabello es largo. It's hair is long, right? Our, our country is beautiful. Nuestro país es bonito. Our country is beautiful. Their, right? Their food, no. Their food, uh -huh. their food is delicious. Su comida is deliciosa. For example, Mexico, I don't know. Mexico is beautiful and its food is delicious. Okay, see the examples we have here. Our teacher's name is, for example, our teacher's name is? Kevin. Uh-huh. Our teacher's name Kevin. is Kevin. Uh -huh. Pedro's address is? Uh -huh. Flor Blanca, neighborhood, intersection this, yeah, the, the, the address. Uh -huh. Melissa. Mm, yeah. Melissa and Dora's last name is? For example, this is just an example. Mr. Corea and Mr. Portillo's name is Jose. Uh -huh. Ambos son namesakes. Ambos son namesakes porque tienen el mismo nombre. Entonces son tocayos. How do you say tocayo in English? Namesake. Namesake. Exactly. Ahí se los puse en el chat. ya. Yeah namesake mm -hmm. because Jose Corea Jose Portillo right they are namesake because they share the same name so Mr. Corea and Mr. Portillo's last name or name in this case is Jose mm -hmm. yes. and only that so do me a favor please students you're gonna um, do the following do it based on your creativity, please. Do this based on your creativity. Your teacher's name is, and invent a name. A classmate occupation is, for example, uh, Luz Angelica's occupation is doctor. Jose's occupation is criminologist or for example, veterinarian. La profesión, la ocupación de José es veterinario, for example, right? Um, let me see, Yesenia's occupation is chef. La ocupación o la profesión de Yesenia es chef. Usen su creatividad para completarlos, okay? Complete them, please. Use your creativity to complete them. Students, please complete them. I have a doubt. Um, in no. the answers, uh, we need to put in, um, like, my teacher name is Kevin? Uh, yeah, correct. Okay, thank you. Yes. Uh, teacher, yes, uh, only the number five. Uh, the exercise, yes, by the moment, just number five. Yes, okay, I finished. Very easy, right? <laughs> right,
Okay, did you finish? Finish, finish class. Uh, did you finish? Students, participants, did you finish? Finalizaron? Yeah. Yes. Not yet. Uh -huh. Para decir todavía no, ¿cómo podemos decir eso? Not yet, teacher. Not yet. Did you finish? Finalizaron? Finish. Mm -hmm. finish. finish, 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 okay, perfect, 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 bien, ready, 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 listos, listos, ready, okay, yes. perfect, perfect, very, very good, I'm going to send you to some rooms right now, En estos momentos los voy a enviar a salas de discusión de cinco o seis miembros de ustedes. Discutan, compartan sus ideas con sus compañeros y yo voy a pasar por ahí monitoreando su trabajo. Luego regresamos todos a esta llamada principal. ¿Ok? Ok. Ok. Perfect. 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 Yes. Um, yes. So. There you go. Um, Yes, yes, yes. Uh, perfect. So there you go. Ahí está ya la invitación para que se unan. Uh -huh. Cada uno. Uh -huh. Joint, joint, joint. Uh -huh. Please. Join, join, join. Uh -huh. Verónica, Claudia, en, ajá. Yes. Acepte la invitación para entrar a una de las salas de discusión with your classmates, con sus compañeros, with the other participants, please. Verónica, Claudia. Enter one of the rooms, please. Ingresen a una de las salas de discusión, Verónica and Claudia. Eh, tú, tú, eh, your family name, eh, Rina and Catherine. Eh, number three, eh, a family occupation, doctor, artist, chef. Number four, a family last name, Sosa, Martínez, Quintanilla. Ese es el ejemplo que los ejemplos que he tenido. No sé, Stephanie, cuáles son los, los que ella tiene. Yo esos cuatro, yo en referencia a mi familia. Okay. Stephanie, no sé. O oh, José, Lice. Eh, y los ejemplos iban a ser este como sea o o así como están ahí, como los puso ahí los ejemplos. Ah, yo, 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 yo ocupé de mi familia, ocupé yo, lo relacioné con mi familia. 
usted ah, lo puede relacionar con compañeros de trabajo, no sé, con los compañeros ah, de clase, el ejemplo. Ajá, porque yo en el primero, por ejemplo, puse... Yesenia, Claudia, las acabo de asignar a una de las salas de discusión para que trabajen con una de sus compañeras. Muy bien, solo tienen que aceptar la invitación, ¿ok? Ok. No, lo siento, no la copié. Quiero ver my class. No, no la copié. Lo siento. Esa no la alcancé a copiar. My classmates occupation is. It is my, my occupation, occupation is accounts assistant. Is a what? Sorry, repeat it. My occupation is... is a student. Okay, uh huh. <laughs> and you are. Uh, <laughs> no, about somebody else. It has to be about somebody else, about another person, Diana. Sobre otra persona. Uh -huh. uh, it is occupation is accounts assistant. Accountant assistant. Accountant assistant. Uh -huh. Accountant assistant. Okay. Very good. Mm -hmm. Yes. Ahí tiene Magdaleno, Reina, to practice. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Practice, okay. practice. Your teacher name? Your teacher's name is? Uh -huh. My teacher's name is Kevin. Is Kevin, uh -huh, for example. Mm -hmm. Correct. Very good. Mm -hmm. Continue, continue, continue. Yes. Painter, secretary. Uh, okay, teacher, I see you. <laughs> um, can you tell me um, what does it mean a butcher? Uh, yes, I didn't listen to you. Can you listen to me now? Yeah, right. Yes. A, a yep. butcher. A butcher. A butcher is a person who chops the meat. For example, when you go to the supermarket, that's the person who chops the meat. La persona que corta las carnes. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. okay, okay. And sells butcher. them. Y las vende. Uh -huh. Y las vende. No, okay, okay, okay. Carnicero. Exactly. Correct. Mm -hmm. ¿Cómo se escribe? How do you spell? B U T so slow <laughs> B U T C H A E R Thank you That's it. Okay. And the others finish practicing? 
Uh -huh. Yeah, we are practice. Nice. Mauricio? Yes, sir. Yes, finish. <laughs> excellent, excellent. Very good. ¿Ya habían hecho alguna actividad así? ¿De hablar en grupos así? ¿Groups like this? No. ¿No? Okay. Solo presencial. <laughs> Ajá. Yes. But the time, right? Esa es la ventaja de ese programa. ¿Ya vieron? Que es de su casa. You can study English and learn and practice. Right? Very Price good. skills. Ajá. Yes. Very good. Very, very good. Okay, so one, like 10 more seconds and then we return. Okay. Mm -hmm. Welcome, welcome back. Finish the practice. Yes, very good. Yes. Very good. Very, very good. Welcome, welcome. Welcome. Thank you. Just wait for the others. Mm -hmm. Yes. Faltan los demás. Senia, Veronica, uh, Reina, Magdaleno, Carla Patricia. No pases la casa, no, no la buscas. The group, so they are the ones missing right now. Yes. Good, good, good. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Everybody here? Yes, ya todos de regreso? Sí? Super. Good, 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 good. Okay, yes. So your teacher's name, use your creativity. Don't just mention me. Mention others. Use your creativity. Uh -huh. My teacher name is Magdaleno. Okay, my <laughs> teacher's name is <laughs> Magdaleno. Magdaleno. <laughs> Uh -huh, okay, very good. Mm -hmm. Another, my teacher's name is? My teacher is my, my sorry. <laughs> Your teacher's name and my teacher's name is Rodrigo. Okay, very good. Number two, your classmate's name. Mm -hmm. Diana? Ajá, uh -huh. I see you want to participate. La veo con muchas ganas de participar, Diana. So, yes, ajá. Uh -huh. Your classmate's name is? Diana? Your microphone, yeah. Need to activate your microphone. My class, my class name, my classmate name is Roberto. Roberto, excellent, very good, yes. Very, very good. Uh, a classmate's occupation is? My classmate occupation is accountant assistant. Accountant assistant, okay. Is accountant assistant, very good. Mm -hmm. Excellent, and? Uh, a classmate's last name is? Mm -hmm. A last name is Quintanilla. 
Okay. A classmate's name is, well, last a name. Class, last name. A class, a classmate. Ay, ¿cómo se pronuncia? A classmate's. A classmate. Last name. Last name. Is. Is Quintanilla. Quintanilla, ajá. Uh -huh. Is Quintanilla. Very good. Excellent. Good job. Good, good job, students. Yes. Mm -hmm. Excellent. So this is, as you can see, this is really easy. It's not complicated at all, right? It doesn't take um any like longer, right? So this is what you're going to do in this moment. You are going to fill in the blanks with a classmate's information. You just have to complete this mini exercise. We complete it together real quick. First name, middle name, last name. For example, first name, Kevin. Middle name, Alexander. Last name, Velasquez. Occupation, teacher. Boss name, um, Miss Elena Mendez. Workplace, Inglés Corporativo. Okay? Uh -huh. But not about you, about somebody else, another classmate, another person, sobre otra persona, okay? Do it please in this moment, then we check together. We check and we share together. And uh, teacher, uh, yes? with real information? Not necessarily. What I want to check is the practice. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, thanks to you. Teacher. Yes. Carla? How do you say in English contador? Accountant. Accountant. Thank you. Yes. Finish. Okay. Mm -hmm. Teacher, how do you say técnico de campo? Técnico? Técnico de campo. Yeah, that's going to be a technician. Though, I'm not sure you, if you can use field, like field technician. I'm not pretty sure about it. If you can say it like this, field technician mm -hmm. or outsider technician. Outsider technician. Mm -hmm. Yes. Diana Margarita. Mm -hmm. Este teacher, eh, ¿cómo se le dice a la persona que está encargada del área de cobros? Uh, how, how do you say to the person? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Repeat, repeat. Perdón. How do you say? Uh -huh. ah, how do you say to the person? To the person in charge of in charge of in charge of cobros you said right cobros uh -huh. cobros uh cashier then a cashier a cashier uh -huh. in the chat in the chat i wrote the word for you cashier okay <laughs> cashier yes okay Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. Reina, finish. Yes. Okay. Lisef, finish. 
Lucía, Gabriela, Verónica. Did finish. you finish? Okay, uh, I finish. You finish, excellent. Very good. Okay, finish. Finish, perfect. Perfect, very good. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're gonna check. Let's start with Mauricio, please. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. Yeah. First name Mary. Middle name Anne. Last name Melgar. Occupation Field Technician. Boss name Rodrigo Hernandez. Workplace CVX. CVX, okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. Very good. Very, very good. Thank you. Uh, somebody else who wants to share another participant, another student who wants um, to share? Yes. Okay. That I changed something. <laughs> okay, no problem. Okay. Uh, the first name, Camila. Uh, middle name, Jimena. Mm -hmm. Last name, Herrera. Yes. Occupation, a student. Mm -hmm. Um. A study play, uh, not boss name because it's a little girl, but mother name Luz and a study place uh, in bilingual college, John Frank Adams. Okay, very good, very, very good. Excellent, excellent, excellent. One more, please, one more participants. Yes, please, Rain. Yeah. Yeah, teacher. Uh -huh. Yeah, teacher. Yeah. Okay, uh, Reina and then yeah. Veronica. Uh -huh. Okay, first name, Madeline. And then Yvette, sorry. Uh -huh. <laughs> Middle name, Liliette. Last name, Brioso. Mm -hmm. Occupation, doctor. Yes. Boss. Name Romeo Jaimir Ventura okay. and the workplace Hospital Rosales or Rosales yeah, Hospital. Rosales, Hospital. Yeah. Yes, <laughs> the first one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Excellent, Reina. Very good. Veronica and then Ibeth. Uh -huh. uh, Ibeth. You can, yeah. Puede ser inventado. Yeah, can be. Uh, first, first name, Catherine. Middle name. Sorry. Uh, mid... uh, middle name is... Uh, um, uh, uh, mid lane, mid name, name is, is, is middle name. Uh, middle, middle name is el segundo nombre. Exactly, correct. Okay, uh, Vanessa, okay. Uh, last name, uh, Ramirez. Okay. Occupation uh, is accountant. Accountant. Uh, both name, uh, both, both name, uh, uh, Miss Catherine. A okay. workplace a, in hot in hot war story. Okay, very good. Yes, totally correct. Very good. And then we move on with Ibeth. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Hmm? First name Claudia. Middle name said Last name Garcia. Mm -hmm. Occupation secretary. Secretary. Boss, mm -hmm. 
Bosnay Daniel Arevalo. Mm -hmm. And workplace, yes. Excellent. Very good. Yes, correct. Totally correct. Excellent. Okay, participants, we did it. We finish another round. Excellent. Did you learn something new? Aprendieron algo nuevo esta noche? Did you? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes? Yes or no? Yes. 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 Uh -huh. For example? Yes. For example? Mm -hmm. How to use apostrophe? How to use apostrophe? Okay. Very good. What else? Adjective. They, they use you they use pronouns and no no mm -hmm. the use of the nouns mm -hmm. oh yeah the possessive yeah. the possessive adjectives possessive adjectives right very good very very good excellent very good the difference in, in singular and plural mm -hmm. the differences between singular and plural right Yes, the differences between singular and plural. Excellent, very good. So, a es, esta noche le toca la sesión individual a Stephanie. La sesión de los 10 minutos, ¿verdad? Ya tuvimos con Reina, Claudia, right? So, um, it's, uh, it's going to be the chance, it's going to be the time right now of Stephanie. Este día le corresponde los 10 minutos de sesión personalizada a Stephanie. Eh, just to remind you about, solo para recordarles, por favor, no olviden que tienen que todos los días, de preferencia después de la clase, visitar la plataforma donde tienen sus actividades y sus evaluaciones. Ahí las tienen que completar, ¿ok? Tal cual les explicaron en la sesión de inducción. Entonces ya está la pregunta. Recuérdense que al finalizar ahí siempre les aparecen todos los videos las, de, de estas clases, ¿verdad? Eh, en orden, va todo en orden, no hay donde perderse. Entonces ahí ustedes ven el video y abajo siempre les coloco una pregunta a la cual deben de responder. Es una pregunta tipo foro, es un foro abierto. ¿Ok? So, tienen que responderlo aparte de completar su tarea. También invito a Stephanie y a Verónica. Espero que hayan revisado esas partes también. Y los demás, ¿verdad? Lo que le falta. Recuérdense que that is important. Ese es uno de sus compromisos, de sus obligaciones. ¿Ok? Ok. okay. Thank you very okay. much. Thank okay, you thank very you. much. Good thank practice. You. Solo, se, solo me quedo con Stephanie por unos minutos and then uh, we finish. ¿Ok? So, the others, the rest. Good evening. Bye bye. Good evening, classmates. Good evening. Bye bye. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Bye. Bye. Good evening. Take care. Yeah, goodbye. See goodbye. you. Bye -bye. Goodbye. Take care. Bye bye. Bye bye. 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 Take good care. Take good care of yourself. Bye bye. Dear students, take good care of yourselves. Mamita, y la Holly que va take a comer. Care. Take good care of yourself. Mm -hmm. Yes. Perfect. Uh huh. Yes, very good. Stephanie, good evening. I don't know if you can listen to me, Stephanie. Si me escucha? Yes, perfect. Uh, is there, Stephanie, any topic that uh, you want to discuss about? ¿Hay algún tema de los que hemos visto? Bueno, usted no ha podido estar presente en dos de las sesiones, ¿verdad? So, algún tema que yo pueda aclararle ahorita en estos momentos que podamos hacer así como un quick review, un repaso general, simple. Steph. Mm -hmm. Ok, today's topic. Ok. Ajá, possessive eh, adjective, right? Ok, perfect. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Mm -hmm. There you are. So this one, right? Yes. Ok. 
So in this case, for the possessive adjectives, uh, Stephanie, we use them to describe possession, something that is mine, something that belongs to me, algo que me pertenece, algo que es mío. For example, my backpack, my cell phone. Imagine I have this cell phone, right, for example, and I tell you, this cell phone is mine. I have to tell you, my cell phone, possession, my, my cell phone. Mm -hmm my computer, you are my student, okay? Like that, okay? Yes? Excellent. Then we have your, your computer, su computadora, your, your computer. Luego está his and her. His, it's for boys and her, is for girls. His is, va a ser para niños, para hombres, y her va a ser para niñas, para mujeres, ¿ok? Hurt. His hurt. ¿Ok? Her notebook. Or her hair. Su cabello. A girl. Una chica. Una señorita. Right? His car is blue. Su carro, su automóvil, es azul para un chico. Right? His. It's represents something neutral. El it's representa algo neutro, ¿verdad? Algo como que no queremos ser muy específicos, generales. Por ejemplo, El Salvador en its culture uh, are beautiful. El Salvador y su cultura son bonitas, right? Me estoy refiriendo a algo abstracto, en este caso un país, right? Algo, un, un lugar en este caso, ¿verdad? A place, right? A country. Entonces digo su, porque yo no sé si el Salvador es femenino o masculino. So it's its, right? It's. Uh -huh. El Salvador and its culture. Uh -huh. Your, ahora está, va a decir teacher, pero aquí está your otra vez. No. This is singular, right? Um, el primero es singular. El segundo ya es plural. Your. For example, your students, Kevin, sus estudiantes are good. Kevin, your students are good, right? Your students are good. Mm -hmm. For example, sus estudiantes en plural. Y el otro es your student, su estudiante, right? Our country is beautiful, nuestro. Our country is beautiful. Mm -hmm. Their, their, what? Their students are good. Sus estudiantes. De ellos, right? Refiriéndose a ellos, right? For example, the teachers are good and their students are also good. Esos maestros son buenos y sus estudiantes también son buenos. And their students are also good. Like that, that's all you have to say. That's all you have to, you have to do. Mm -hmm. Okay, Stephanie. Clear? Claro? No sé si ahora le ha dado una idea más clara. Yes? Okay, another doubt? Alguna otra duda? Ah, eh, the alphabet, the alphabet, el alfabeto, right? Mm -hmm. Eso está un poquito quizás más sencillo. Eh, I shared some material with you, right? Uh, related to that eh, in, el, in the group, right? In the group, mm -hmm. I shared some material with you. I'm gonna resend that material to you it, and there is like material about the alphabet, A, B, C, D, E, all of that so you can practice, right? Uh, I'm going to socialize, voy a reenviar eso a usted para que vea ahí el, el material, right? The material. Mm -hmm. Con ese, porque ese es solo practice the pronunciation. Ese es solo práctica de pronunciation. Ajá. Uh -huh. Okay, Stephanie. 
Yes, clear? Perfect, 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 perfect. Excellent, Stephanie. So I see you tomorrow, la veo mañana, temprano, en la clase, puntual, y primero Dios ya con el micrófono listo. Ok. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Ok. Yes, yes, yes. Ok. So thank you, Stephanie. Have a good evening and we see each other tomorrow. Ok. Yes. So bye bye. Take care. Bye bye.